if it ain't broke, don't fix it, as the cliche goes. Um, so, but I do see, you know, I am an advocate of R and life sciences. I'm part of various working groups to help that adoption. We are seeing that tide turn slowly but surely. Um, it just does take a lot of change management, cultural shift, and frankly, buy-in from leadership to really invest in that in that changeover, but also making it easier for their their teams to make that switch. It can be daunting to go from a proprietary type of experience and building these applications to a code first approach. The key is getting them set up on the right foot, automating as much as you can in the setup so that they can really concentrate on learning that new paradigm without feeling like they're just wasting their effort in doing so. 